Welcome to Power for Your Living podcast with Prophet Daniela Mwating, a timely, inspirational, and revelational message to restore your life and destiny. This message gives you the power to live your best life given to you by God. Now, to today's message. The reading of the Word of God, this is the summer of the supernatural and miracles. One thing you've got to understand that as a child of God, walk in the supernatural. The supernatural is able to help you to respond to situations. You know, people who work in the supernatural, number one, they are not normal. They do things that are not normal. When everybody in the family tells them to go on the left, supernatural people go on the opposite. Because the rules and the protocols and the rules of the engagement, you have the ability to break all of them. Now, Jesus, walking on water does not mean you are going to walk on water. It simply means the source of your cases, you have power over it. Because the storms on the sea was coming from the water. So when Jesus walked on the water, he was saying that the source of the situation, I have power over it. Now, Peter gets ready to walk on. And he says, I've been a fisherman for 30 years. I've never walked on water before. And Jesus said, because of my word, you'll be able to do it. When the word of God is activated in your life, you walk in the supernatural. Yes, supernatural people, they walk behind and beyond the natural. Jesus. Say, I'm a person of the supernatural. I'm a person of the supernatural. Say, I'm a spiritual entity. I'm a spiritual entity. Now, before we read the test, at the first service, there's a family here. They have a serious court battle going on. And, and the one that they're having a court battle with, is, with has a, a sister. And the sister one day has told them that, listen to me, because you are having the court battle with my brother, I'll make sure I finish all of you. This is not a dream. This is physical. And this woman is a dangerous, dangerous, dangerous gangalia of a family. So all the time, they say they come to the altar and they pray to God, ten things are wrong. So on Friday, on Thursday, the mother is on the way. Um, the, the lady here, the mother also comes here. So the opponent is fighting them at the court. So the mother is getting ready to come to Trasaco branch at the service over there on Thursday. When the mother was dressing, the door of the wardrobe fell and hit the mother's leg. She went through pain and because of that, she couldn't come to the Trasaco branch. She said, when it fell, she said, God, deliver me and remember me. The same time, they had a phone call. That this family relative that is a gang and they are fighting people got accident at the same time and the two legs are broken. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Jesus. They were here at the first service. And they said, the way the legs are broken, doctor said she can never walk again. The same time something hit the mother, something hit the witch. It means it was coming against the mother Jesus. and God brought a diversion. Yes, a person of the supernatural Jesus. anytime disaster is coming Jesus. God brings a diversion. Yes, Let the altar here bring a diversion. Yes, Let the altar here bring a diversion. Yes, Listen, you are born to receive and enjoy the glory and the grace of God. Jesus. Say I walk in the supernatural. I walk in the supernatural. Can I give you my test? Isaiah chapter 43 verse number 7. And because you are working the supernatural, all the, all, all, all the services to, to August, bring your bottles of oil. And also on Fridays, you are having the 6 to 8.30 meetings. It's been so glorious. It's been so amazing by the grace of God. Amen. Um, um, let's, let's all read together. One, two, three. Let's go, please. Everyone who is called by my name, mm -hmm. whom I created for my glory, yeah. whom I formed and That's, made. Yeah. One more time, let's go. Everyone who is called by my name, yeah. Whom I created for my glory. Yeah. Whom I formed and uh -huh. made. Yeah, everyone who I created for my glory, formed and made. Everyone. So one of the reasons you are supposed to understand why God made you is for one reason. He created you, he made you for his. Glory. For his. Glory. For his. Glory. So help me to give the title of my sermon to your neighbor on your left and right and say my neighbor. My neighbor. If you don't show the glory. If you don't show the glory. God will not be happy. God will not be happy. You may be seated. Amen. God has a reason. God has a plan. When God is doing something, he's doing something. Because God is intentional. And when God is not doing anything, he's still doing something. Because when God is not doing anything intentionally, he is doing something behind the scenes. And any time God is quiet and God is silent, that is the time he's working for somebody behind the scenes. 
And if God is working for somebody behind the scenes, we ought to get time and see what exactly is going on. Now, the supernatural believer, number one, the Christian life is not a religion. The Christian life is a relationship. What is the relationship? I'm supposed to be like him. If I can be like him, I behave the way he behaves. Situations are not supposed to stop me from revealing who I am. Now, Pastor Daniel, why did God create man? From Sunday School 101, they told all of us, including yourself, whether you were in Roman, whether you were in Presby, whether you were in Methodist, they told us one thing. They said God made man for man to worship God. Am I saying the truth at all? I don't know what your Sunday School teacher told you. Now, contrary to popular opinion, I came to let you know that it is wrong. Pastor Daniel, why are you so controversial? I'm I excited you told me I'm controversial. Now, the reason why God made you from this test, he made you to show his glory. But any time you show God's glory, it's a sign of your worship. Because when people see the glory of God around you, they look at you and say, I worship your God. So if I don't show the glory, I'm not letting people worship the Lord. And my glory of God on me does not let people also worship God. And it does not also worship God. So glory is to worship God. Yes, so God made me to worship him. Okay, okay. From Sunday school 101. He made me to worship him. But now anytime people see me because of my case, they nod their head and say that the devil is wicked. Is it glorifying God? No. But when people see me, that what the doctor said about me, God has brought the turn around. They look at you and say, oh my God, come and worship the Lord with me. So the glory of God is a sign of my worship. That's right. The glory of God is a sign of my worship. The glory of God is a sign of my worship. Now we have a problem here. Now, the Bible has used three different words. And if you sit down and you check the three different words, you might be confused. Because why would the Bible say, and I created you for my glory. I formed you for my glory. And I made you for my glory. God, why do you have to repeat yourself and get the revelation here? God never repeated himself. Everything written there is totally different. So now let's begin. I created you. I formed you. I made you. Tell the person around you, create. Create. Form. Form. Make. Make. Now this is it. Now, making or the made is the finishing product. So God now said one day, let us make man after our image. So after everything is being made, the end product is the made. What is the creation? Creation is making something out of nothing. So when God said, let us make man, let there be light. There was no light. Out of nothing, light appeared. So it is called creation. Now, after something is being created, what is being created? When you make something out of what is being created, it is being formed. And what is being formed? How you want the thing to become in your specification is the main point. So clear example, let me begin clear example. I moved to Eastern region, the forest of Eastern region, the forest of Brunhaf region, and I see a tree. Now the tree I see was created by God. The tree was not there and it appeared so great. Tree was? Good class, good class. Tree was? Three was created. Now, a sawmill operator takes a dormant machine, breaks the tree, and turns the tree into wawa boards. Now, the wawa boards that have been made, that is ready for shipment at Tema Harbor. Now, wood has been formed out of the created tree. Don't clap here. So, the tree created, wawa board formed. Now, when the Wawa board enters into China, it enters into America, a piano is made out of it. Mercedes-Benz wants to do a nice vehicle. On the right-hand side in the dashboard, some wood is on there. So the tree that was created, and, and Wawa board formed out of it. Now, a nice panel, a piano, a nice bed, when you go to White House in Washington, D.C., the capital, the chair, the seat, the table, the president of America is sitting on in the Jubilee House of Ghana. It's a table that has been made out of the tree. So the maiden or the making is the end product. So when I appear in my family, hear me right now, I am created. 
how I came to meet in my family, I was formed. But I don't end with formation. Something big shows up in my life yes, and I made somebody victorious. Yes, 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 so although I came from a family yes. where there was premature death, yes, I will not be made for premature death. Yes, but when long life appears, Bye. oh, my family might be a family of poverty. Yes. But when God makes me a millionaire, I have been made. So I start from creation. I get to formation. Yes, but my end will be glorious. Yes, All your friends who saw you yes, in 20 2015. They only saw you in your form moments. But when the glory of God shows up, you will be made into another man. Can I declare to somebody, in your season of supernatural, you are not going to remain in crazy. Not just being formed. But God is about to polish you. Now in the moment of polishing, he places some things on you. So that when people see you, they cannot recognize you. When people see you, they will see something different in you. Because when the supernatural glory shows up, you are created, you are formed, and you are made. Say, preach Daniel. Preach Daniel. Preach Daniel. That's what I was born to do. Now sit down and look at this. Okay. Let me go to another scenario. Um, God declares, let there be. Say, let there be. Let there be. And God said, let there be iron on the ground. And all of a sudden, we have iron ore, right? Now, when we have iron ore, iron ore is being mixed. You know, um, the iron um, Fe3O2 from um, chemistry. You know, um, we join to other things. We have, you know, the steel. And um, steel is being formed. Now, when the steel is being formed, it gets to Germany in assembly plants of Mercedes-Benz. Now, when the steel is being made, they look for some engine somewhere. They look, you look for some metals over there. When you go to the assembly plant and the manufacturing plant, what you see over there is dirty. You see engine. You see some metals. But after they join them together, being formed, they look for a sprayer. Sprays the vehicle in white, in black, in cream. And they move it from the assembly plant into the showroom. Now, in the showroom, you have different lights in the ceiling. When it gets over there, people will ask you one question, and you tell them, made in Germany. Wait, God created the iron. God created the iron ore. Human being formed still out of it. And human being made a vehicle out of it. But when it was being done in the assembly plant, the car was ugly. But when it's being polished, you see something different. So when God is about to put his glory on you, he takes you to a moment of polishing. Now, after they do the polishing, they do something they call quality assurance. Quality assurance to make sure that this one has no issue. And they put a stamp of, of approval on it from R&D. When they put on it, they announce that it is ready for market. So from Germany, it will get to England. It will get to Accra. It will get to Afghanistan. It will get to different places. But before it went out, there was a seal of approval. So when God created you, he placed a seal of approval. My God. So if you don't like me, I don't care. Because somebody else has already placed yes, a, a seal. A seal. A seal of approval Jesus. over my life. Yes, so the Bible says, let the weak say, I am strong. Oh. Let the poor say, I am rich. Because I don't move by what I see. Ah. I move by what has been said yes, over my life. Yes, because what has been said over my life yes, is bigger than what I see. Yes, because what I see was made by what God said. Jesus. Sometimes, you hear me? Sometimes, if you don't believe what you see, believe what God said. That's right. So, so, uh, you know, now, um, now, the same test, the same test. Let me say supernatural. Supernatural. Give me the KG version and see how it's so glorious over there. Look at it. Everyone that is called by my name, I've created him for my glory. glory. I have formed him. Now, the problem here is, yea, I have made him. Pastor Daniel, the yea that was placed there changes the whole scenario. I've created him. Okay, all right. I formed him, normal. Yeah, I have made him. It has changed the scenario. What's the meaning? 
I wrote this book. I created it from my head. I formed the book. Later I say, yeah, I made it. It means I am so proud of the book. Because when I say, yeah, I made it. Sure. If you have any question, come to me. Yeah, I made it. So look at me. The glory that is coming. Say it's not your mother. Say it's not your father. Before your father and your mother went on their first dates, God already had already approved of you already. He had already shown something great over your life. Yeah, I made you. So if you don't like me, somebody already said they made me. Now, have you known this situation? It gives you the reason to walk in the supernatural. Because I'm supposed to show the glory of God. So now, why does trouble come to a human being? I'm, I'm very analytical because I read engineering. So I like to break things down so that we can argue. Can, can we argue? Sure. Now, why does a trouble or trouble come on a person? Why? Why will you sleep one day, then trouble? Court case. There's issue. Be a so you go through this case. Let me tell you the reason for every trouble in a person's life. The reason for every trouble in the reason for every trouble in a person's life is just one so that you cannot reveal his glory. Because when trouble comes, the assignment of trouble from Satan is to cover you from revealing his glory. So anytime God gives me a testimony, trouble is being re- removed, then I reveal his glory. Yes, Lord. So anything that stops you from revealing his glory Jesus. is trouble. So one day, Jesus, walking on the roadside, sees a blind man. And religious people said, Jesus, who sinned? Mother or father? Jesus said, shut up, keep quiet. Nobody sinned. But for the glory of the Lord to be revealed, so anytime there is trouble, it comes to cover the glory. But when the glory, trouble is removed, glory is revealed. Oh, I can, I, they, they can put this one on Twitter for me. When the trouble is removed, glory is revealed. When the it's trouble not. is removed, glory is revealed. When the trouble is removed, glory, glory is, revealed. is revealed. So the assignment of trouble is to make sure you don't exhibit and reveal the glory of the living God. And today from this consecrated altar, yes. may you walk in the place of the supernatural. Amen. Now, now listen to me. Supernatural people cannot be understood. You cannot understand a supernatural person. There is a young guy in the Bible, the name is called Moses. Do you all remember him? One guy. You remember sure. him? When they gave birth to him, something strange happened. They took a basket, right? And um, they put a boy in the basket. On top of River Now. Now, number one, River Now has a lot of crocodile. But they place the boy in the River Now. Number two, he is in the basket. But somewhere, somehow, the boy did not sink. Clear example. Now, let's go to Akimdi's principle and law of flotation. Because the weight of the fruit displays, when it's equal to the weight of the object on it, it will sink. According to Akimdi's principle. So, look at it right now. Now, go to the river in your area and look for a basket from your house. And Auntie Matilda, put just a stone inside of the basket. What will happen? See. Now, the weight of Moses and the stone, which one is bigger? Moses. So if anything is supposed to sink, it's not the stone, it's supposed to be Moses. But Moses was still floating. It means what sank other people. Jesus. You are about to float on top. Yes, Lord. Oh, 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 oh. Second service, Jesus. I can't feel you. I said, what sank other people? Yes, Lord. What brought other people down? Yes, Lord. I said, you shall float on top by fire. Yes, now, floating simply means elevation. So, what brings other people down? I'm a person of the supernatural. Jesus. I am wired different. Yes, Lord. I am different. Yes, Lord. Sound, I am different. I am different. Say I am different. I am different. Say I am different. I am different. Say I don't go by the laws. I don't go by the laws. I don't go by the rules. I don't go by the rules. I write my own laws. I write my own laws. I write my own rules. I write my own rules. Sit down for a minute. I'm trying my best. I'm trying my best. Thank you. Um, 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 I have five minutes to finish and look at this right now. Um, the laws of Ghana is so amazing, right? 
But the conditions of Ghana affect people differently. Okay, let me come around the mountain. Here I come. The laws of Ghana is for everybody. If you cross red light, what happens? What happens? You are arrested. Good. The laws is for everybody. But the conditions are different. What's the condition? Somebody lives in your same area. The whole day, they will not get money to buy food. But you also live in the same area. But you eat and give some to your dog. So we are ruled by one law, by our con. Yes, Lord. Jesus. My God. We all graduated on the same day. Somebody will get a job tomorrow. Somebody will take five years. We are all in the nation, but conditions are different. Jesus. So what causes my conditions to be different is when I become abnormal yes. because I work in the supernatural. Jesus. So although it's taking five years to get jobs, I, I get a job the next day. Yes, Lord. Oh, the last person to say the amen will be there. Jesus. Uh, um, uh, many people don't know. Unfortunately, um, uh, people are supposed to pray in this nation. Tell somebody, pray in the nation. Pray in the nation. Now, the reason why you are supposed to pray for this nation now, forget about all your party colors. If you don't get to the realm where the, the nation prays, for God to bring people who have this one, we are in trouble. Uh, a statistics were being made, was being made it is in Ghana. And as of this year, from January to April, the number of applications that have entered into Canadian embassy this year, from January all the way to April, is 63,375 people. I'm repeating one more time. 63,375 people have made applications to go to Canada to leave the nation. Now, the number of applicants, only, this is only for four months. Now, the whole of last year, it was 62,151 people have made application. You might think it's a joke. Now, our human, human resources is going, skills are going, human capitals are going. When you are sick, a doctor that will help you is going. If you are not careful, we are being left with trouble. The mechanic that will do your car is going. The teacher that will teach your children is going. The driver that will drive you is. The lady that will do your seamstress. Uh, uh, yeah. Your makeup is, is doing all this good. It's going. So it's, it's, the plumber is going. Now Ghana, you can't get plumber. In Ghana, if you want to get somebody to do POP, you are in trouble. If the person doesn't come from Togo, you are in trouble. Child of God, where the nation is going to. But there's a sharp rise because this year, low four months, 63,000. Last year, 62,000. 2021, Auntie Matilda, it was only 9,109. So, 9,000 only three years ago. Now, 63,000. And December has not come. Now, out of the 62,151 that applied last year, the success rate, the people that got their visas were 33,756. They are all gone. And out of the 33,000 that have gone, how many of them are come to help the nation back? They only come after they are 60 years, after they are 70 years. So human brain, human mind, to change everything is going. And what am I trying to say? It's the condition. But in as much as the condition is bad, I don't live in the economy of Ghana. Yes, Lord. I'm a supernatural person. Jesus. May something massive change on my behalf. Amen. So I came here to declare over your business and everything that you do. Jesus. May your business get to the next level. Yes, Lord. Oh, I don't have business people here. Yes, Lord. All the business people I came to declare over you. Yes, all entrepreneurs I declare unto you. Yes, all consultants. Yes, all business people. Yes, all corporate people. Yes, I move to your workplace. Yes, your promotion is coming. Your promotion is coming. Your elevation is coming. Jehovah is surprising you. Something is shifting on your behalf. So it's changing on my behalf. Sit down for one minute to finish. Sit down for one minute to finish. So when I walk in the supernatural, now supernatural, hear me right now, becomes my lifestyle. When I don't like anything, I'm supposed to wake up in the morning. And declare that this family hear my voice. I am a candidate to change anything at all and everything. Child of God, supernatural people cannot be understood. And let me advise you. Everybody you see in life believes in something. There is nothing that is called an atheist. 
Somebody shows you I'm an atheist. It's a lie. Everybody's feet is on something. Some people tell you, oh, don't go to church and don't believe in it. They have where they go to. It's only, it's only the 21st century New Pentecostal Christian who only goes to church once in a month and they don't, are not active and serious. When was the last time you placed your oil on your head? The Bible says, let not your head lack oil. But those who are into other things, they do it religiously. Child of God, there's a place you need to get to the realm. We don't move in the realm of the physical. We don't move in the realm of the physical. The person you are seeking the hand, you have no idea. If it's not the supernatural, a, te a testimony was given on Friday. The sister was here at the first service. A sister that husband died seven years ago. No, no, when the husband died, the husband left her acres of land, prime location. Seven years, nobody has told her. No, no, the document is with the husband's best friend. One day we're having a service over here. And, I, and she said, I declared that whoever has taken anybody's property, let the altar bring it back now. She said she was there. The first man friend called from America and said, I'm coming to Ghana. Can I meet you? She said, why? The person said, I want to meet you. He said, listen, I can't sleep. Your husband is hunting me. We bought this property. I have my own. My other friend has. And your husband's own is this. This is for you. Your name is on it. After seven years. This is it. This is the lady. Now, thank you. You can take it off. Now, hear me. It is not the husband that was hunting the man. It is the altar that was tormenting the man. My God, my God. So if anybody has taken what belongs to you, Jesus. let this altar be activated. Yes, I said your marriage, your favor, your long life, yes, your peace of mind, yes, the Lord. success of your children, yes, your pregnancy, yes, I release it to your direction. Amen. Say, I receive all of them. I receive all of them. I'm a child of God. I'm a child of God. And I walk in the glory. I'm a walk in the glory. Now, this last one minute, this is it. Now, to walk in the supernatural, you are supposed to ask God to show you and take you to your location. Child of God, no matter what you carry, if you miss your location, you cannot exhibit his glory. Pastor Daniel, why? When you take a nice butterfly, have you seen a butterfly before? Oh, oh. Yes. Is it pretty? Is it beautiful? Yeah. Good colors. Yeah. Take the butterfly and put it in the air. It will show the colors well. Put the same butterfly in a swimming pool and tell the butterfly to swim. swim. The, the colors will go away. So it's not about you don't carry something you know, where you are. Yeah. The one that is clapping, you got my revelation. You can be good, but wrong location will suck at you. But with the supernatural, it orders your steps Jesus. for you to be at the right place, yes, at the right time, Jesus. to meet the right person. Yes, second, scenario, second scenario, um, take a nice tilapia fish and throw it in the air and put it by your house on the, on the grass and tell tilapia swim. It will be like this more. It will die off. Because the fans and the girls cannot do anything again. Child of God, where are you located? Are you at the right location? Even in church, which church are you planted? Which altar are you planted? You see a nice G65, Gulf Stream, private jet, amazing. Put a nice G65 on the Temamoto way and tell the private jets. Fly on the motorway, let's see. It was cut off a my crash. G65, $40 million, $50 million, but it can skid off and fall down because it was not made for Tema Motorway. But the same G65, put it in the air and you see how it will flow. People are telling you are nobody because you are on a motorway, but let them get ready for you in the air. Yeah. What is inside yes, of you will show up in Jesus' name. Yes, can take one of the nice... One of the best and nice private jet um, is owned by a Saudi Arabian man, Prince Awalid Ben Tala. Amazing. Inside of it has gold interior. Media, do they have it? Do they have it? Look at it right now. Crazy. 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 Amazing. 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 But, the, the, but, but no, but the top one, give me the top one. The top one is for Prince Awalid, the owner of Four Seasons Hotel. That the first one you place on there. Thank you. That, that one, private jet. Prince, our lead. Um, he's, he's also a shareholder in Citibank in America. Um, plenty of um, companies. 
He owns different, different percentages inside. And this private jet, if you come and put this private jet on the Spinters Road, <laughs> and you tell the private jet, fly. The, 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 the private jet will start crying. <laughs> it will start being to 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 Because the location is not good. Some of you, God made you like press our list jets. Yeah. But where you are kept is not exhibiting his glory. Jesus. But as a man of God, I came to move you to yes, a place Lord. where the glory will be revealed. Jesus. Where the glory will be revealed. Jesus. Where the glory will be revealed. Jesus. Now, anything stopping your glory Jesus. by the altar in the testimony city, Jesus. I reverse it, I divert it, yes, I change it right now. Yes, Tell the altar, Tell the altar. Yes, Something is changing. Something Jesus. is moving. I reverse I move, I change, I turn it around. Let the altar, 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 let the altar. When you tell that you move, then you tell that you move. Let the altar, man of God, let's do for me. Yes. Ratapa. Saba. Lato. Zakaya. Yaya. Lebranda. Zekaya. Let the altar be activated. That's what it is. Traffic has happened here. Check other places. Tell the person around you to um, uh, build a cathedral. 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 Amen. First service, there was this stampede. Second service, to the same. Third service, to stampede. Now, sit down and let me tell you one thing. And we have a um, Thanksgiving here today. We'll do a Thanksgiving for a family. Put a medical doctor, a specialist, put him in the court and tell him to be a lawyer. He will disgrace himself. Until FBI and CIA and BNR come and arrest him. Am I saying the truth? That's right. Although you studied as a medical doctor, you can't be a lawyer. That's right. Because you have not studied. The law court is the wrong place. But the same medical doctor, give him and put him in the theater. That's right. And give him knife. Yeah. He will cut you like something. My God. But when he finishes, Jesus. he will join you together. That's right. And put, and put a, a, a lecturer. Put a lecturer and a doc and, and, and a lawyer. Put them in a surgical theater and, and give them a knife and tell them to do cutting. He will kill all your family members. Jesus. By the time you come, blood will be everywhere. The only thing we say that is that I'm sorry. It's not his fault. Wrong location. Wrong location. I'm trying my best. Give my microphone to a mechanic and tell him to preach. He will insult all of you. But go and give your car to the mechanic My and God. give him only for four hours. Yes, your car will change. Yes, Lord. Location. Location. He says, and the knowledge of the glory of God shall fill the whole earth. You have to exhibit his glory. We are getting to a realm, a location where when people look at you, they will see God's glory. Now, the person of the supernatural, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Friday prayer meeting will come off. Um, the next week of the supernatural is this. Because of the supernatural, I am untouchable. Amen. Um, a sister contacted me after Trasaco branch on last Thursday. She called me and said, Prophet, please, there's an emergency. I said, what's the emergency? Said, I have a friend. The problem is too much. And I've bragged to the person about this altar. So, Prophet, if God doesn't come true. And I'm saying, I now come to come me. <laughs> Why? This person is lifting oil to bring it to Ghana. And LC has delayed. Letter of credit has delayed. And they gave him up to 6 p.m. on that Thursday. And this time around, these people are calling me. It is 10 p.m. So why are you calling me? Because they gave them up to 6 p.m. If the LC is not released, the oil cannot be lifted. And you have waited at 10 p.m. And I said, boss, 10 p.m. The brother said, I don't know, but I know God can do something. But they say, when you pray, God answers. Then I said, I have to now take myself out and give it to the altar. So I said to the man, the altar of God will speak for you. Amen. I said, so what do you want God to do? He says, ah, people in El Bujai are looking for that oil. And it was coming directly to us, but now it has to be diverted to Abijai. 
I said, no, heaven will speak. I prayed on the altar. We prayed on the altar. Sent a message to the friend. I said, hey, that your God is good. Tell your pastor, thank you. They called me this morning that they've given us up to 2 p.m. on Friday for us to produce the LC. They produce the LC before the 2 p.m. The oil is coming. Amen. The guy now told the lady, I'll follow you to your church. Glory doesn't let you talk long. Glory lets you know that Jehovah is a good God. We are about to get to that realm. We are moving to that realm. And that's what the body of Christ has to get to. If the body of Christ do not move in the supernatural, there's got to be a time where before we start meeting, stones will be blown. And people know that Jehovah is still alive. Don't be shy of your God. Jesus. Reveal your God everywhere you go. Yes, Lord. A woman, Mrs. Oti, is selling a property. And while selling the property, the friend told her that there's one lawyer that can help you, but his price is high. But he can help you to let it go quick. She said, I will go. The person said, but the, the price is high. She said, I will go. Before she went, she said she took her mantle and placed it here. Thinking she's covering the mantle so that God will speak to her. Speak for her. So she has a mantle, has covered it. When she sat down, starting to talk to the lawyer, the lawyer said, before I talk to you, I'm coming. The lawyer went to pick handkerchief, the same mantle, and wiped the face. Then she too took the mantle from here and showed the lawyer. The lawyer looked at her and said, we are from the same family. The lawyer said, I go to poet. She said, I'm going to poet. She said, because of that, I'll do it for you easily. My God, my God, my God, my God. Listen, that is the realm. Slow. Dr. Labi, medical doctor here, a child, Falls down from two stories. Falls down from two stories. Hit the ground. Put the picture there when the child falls down from two stories. Doctor said, this thing, by now, blood is leaking in the brain. By now, scars are broken. The mother said, before you do the scan, give me one minute. The mother, give it to me right now. The mother took the mantle and placed it on the head of the child. And said, before you do the scan for my child, I'm putting this mantle. The moment she put the mantle on the child, the medical doctor then said, hold on. The medical doctor put, took mantle out of his pocket and said, sister, do you go to Pori? She said, yes. The doctor said, me too, I go to Pori. The doctor said, because you go to Pori, this mantle will cause something to happen. Uh, By the grace of God. Isnam, are you Jesus. there? Isnam, are you there? He says, I'm here. Where is it? Do you have it? Where is it? Where's Isinam? Jesus Christ, man. <laughs> We've been showing this for a long time. Where's Kwame? Is Kwame here? Kwame too is not here. Kwame. 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 <laughs> Kwame. You are, you are the leader. If you can change them, change them. So if you're not, I'm in trouble. Have you seen? We even showed it at first service. So this is the child. After the head has crashed. After the head has crashed. Put the mantle there. About to put, do the scan. The doctor said, the mantle you have seen is familiar to me. The doctor also took his own and said, me too, I'll go to Pui. So take the child there. They checked. They checked the scar. No bone broken. Yes, Lord. No bone broken. Yes, Lord. No bone broken. is broken. Yes, Lord. Listen to me. My this Lord. is how the glory is revealed. Yes, Lord. And today I came to move you to that realm. Uh, when supernatural is not at work, witches are happy. Witches are excited because anything can happen. No. Don't let witches be happy. Let them see the glory you carry. Amen. A Jesus young girl man. at the age of 27 years gets stroke. Family brings the young girl here. Pray for the young girl who cannot walk, who cannot move. Her hands are like this. Mouth excused. We prayed for her. You also what happened? The power of God was at work. Put the interface on there. Power of God has worked and God brought supernatural victory. Now, when this girl was healed, now, this is the most dangerous thing, Pastor Joseph. The father is in America, New York. No, no, any time the father picks phone to call these people, the father also has the right-hand side gone off. My God. Stroke. When he puts the phone down, he became fine. He becomes fine. So when this girl was healed of the stroke, the one we placed on there, and when, when they came to my office, I told them where the thing was coming from. That is from your father's house. May God turn things around. After we prayed, 
the father was there in America last two weeks. He early in the morning, he is going to open his bonnet in the car. He opened the bonnet. New York snake in the bonnet. That's why. This is not Arizona or Florida. Without whether, 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 whether the weather is for snakes. He killed the snake. After killing the snake, the father too, today is free. Amen. Put a picture of the snake there that the man sent. Yes, Lord. This is the snake. Uh, this, is called, this is called America snake. This is called America snake. And yeah, nobody will tell you it was, it was from your hometown. Sound of God. Listen to me. This is America. In a car, in a car, in a car, in a car. If it's not God that came through, put a family on there. If it's not God that came through, what this the, this the girl, the girl in jeans. Doctors look at the girl and call her a wonder girl right. because cancer, sorry, stroke could not kill her. Child of God, I came to introduce you to a realm of glory. Yes, Lord. What you need to do. Love your neighbors yourself. Amen. Love people. Amen. Don't harbor evil towards people. Jesus. Love people. When they wish you evil, keep quiet and come to the altar. Amen. Yes, Lord. When they wish you evil, yes, Lord. Go, come. Come. When they wish you evil, how are you? Fine. Go. Jehovah. Jesus. And nobody wants me to die. Jesus. Let them re- die. That's how, that's how you operate. The only time you reply back is when a negative word is mentioned. When a negative word is mentioned in front of you, don't make man from man for so. Yes, Stop it right there. Yeah. When they tell you, you not make it say, I will. Make it. When they tell you, you die, say, You will rather die with your children. Yes, why, 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 why? Pastor Daniel, who are you telling us this? The answer is in the test. Can I give you the answer? Yes. The most popular scripture in the world. That's where the answer is. Isaiah 54 verse 17. That's where the answer is. Look at it now. Let's go. No, no we- weapon. Look, look, look at it. Listen. Listen. No weapon formed against you will prevail. It means when they send weapons against you, God will stop it for you. Yes, Lord. But the moment any tongue works against you, read this. I read this. You will refuse. You will refuse. Every so anybody who talks against you is not the assignment of God. Who will do it? Me. Oh, El Rade, yes, El Rade, El Rade. Yes, Lord. Shaka. Give me the KGB version. It, it gives it a, a good translation there. So, Obika said, Yawa, men kocha yung, Ewa. And every tongue. Let's all read the every tongue. Let's go. And every tongue that shall rise against thee in judgment. Thou shalt condemn. Be on your feet. So when they say negative things, don't go and cry and say, No, there and then refuse it. Condemn, condemn. There and then. Do what? Refuse it. Refuse it. There and then. As a refusing, it's not going to say you refuse. So what you need to do, God will not do. Yes, Tell the person around you, if you don't do, if you don't do, he will not do. He will not do. And what he has to do, and what he has to do, he will do. He will do. Lift up your right yes, hand. Lord. Yes, One Lord. prayer. Tuesday, Wednesday, we pray seriously. The Friday prayer meeting, don't miss it. And next, supernatural makes me untouchable. Say by fire. By fire. I am untouchable. I am untouchable. By the supernatural. By the supernatural. I review the glory. I review the glory. By the supernatural. By the, the supernatural. supernatural. I review the glory. I review the glory. Let me give you this good news. Can I give you this good news? Yes. Last Thursday morning, around 9 a.m., I had appointment with some people. There's a family who that came here, married for six years, no baby. Prayed for them on the altar, gave them the interface and also the testimony when the pregnancy and everything. It's now you have to do a serious overhaul over there. Serious overhaul. Overhauling machine. <laughs> and the family came here, six years, no baby. Prayed on the altar, gave them a direction. After three months, they became pregnant. And the girl has given birth to twins. This is the pregnancy. Let's see the twins. I want to show you something. Let's go. The, the twins. By the grace of God, the twins have Jesus. come. So on Thursday, I had appointment with them because they have come from America. So they're about to do baby, baby dedication. So they said, Prophet, if you don't, these, these are the babies. These are the babies. These are the babies. You can take it off. These are the babies. 
So they've come from America, about to do dedication. Say, prophet, you have to put the hand on the children before family members come. Family members, family, 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 family members come. Before loved ones come. Before loved ones. Before congratulations come. Because it's not every congratulation that is congratulations. Some congratulations are. Anybody congratulating you, but it's casting you behind the scenes. Let this altar reply them back. So when they came to me and they were thanking me and everything, I had another appointment with another family, 930. So this family, our appointment, Yekasache, so it entered into 930 something. So the other family also came. And now the other family, they've been married for some time looking for baby. So when I saw them from the screen and the pastor told me that they have come, I said, let the people at the reception also come. They said, Papa, these people are two years. They have not finished. I said, no, let the reception people also come. When they came, I told this family, look at them. I told them, hug them. When they hugged, they said, Prophet, why? I said, Sister, the reason why I made you to come to the office to hug this family is because this lady carrying the child, the twins laughing. Last year by this time, she was crying like you. They were looking for baby. So as God has done for them, as you hug them, it has transferred. Yes, Lord. Jesus. Then come and see proper hug. Hug. What am I saying? Your testimony will encourage another person. Say by the altar. By the altar. Let my testimony. Let my testimony. Encourage other people. Encourage other people. Love God. Love your neighbor. Have a good heart. Don't forget your sacrifices and your tithes. Where you put your tithe, the altar your tithe on signifies where you'll be tomorrow. Be a giver. Support humanity. Read your Bible. Have clear conscience. Don't wish evil for anybody. Mm -hmm. Live a holy life. Be prayerful. Yes. Never fast on the day of the never forget to fast on the day of the week you are born. I've been fasting for the past 120 days. Saw the face of God. And God has been doing amazing things. One prayer as you got and pray. We have just about 50 minutes to go home for the sixth test service to come. Say by the altar. By, by the, the altar. altar. Anything stopping the glory. Anything, Anything stopping, stopping the, the glory. glory. I reverse it. I reverse, I reverse it. it. Let me show the glory. Let it show. Let me show the glory. Let, Let me show, show the, the glory. glory. Myself and my family. Myself, Myself and my family. And my loved ones. And my loved ones. Clap your hands and pray now. Let's pray for three minutes. Let's pray for three minutes. Sabayaba. joining us on Power for Your Living podcast. You can contact Prophet Daniela Martin on www.danielamartin.net or call the toll-free number 1-844-314-7337 or call plus 233-240-799910 or email amoatt at hotmail.com. If you are blessed by this message, you can prayerfully consider partnering with this ministry by giving your offering on www.danielamwating.net or cash app, dollar sign, power of worship, one, or PayPal, info at danielamwating.net or MTN mobile money, 055-0000881. Thank you. You can worship with Prophet Daniela Mwating at Power of Worship International Ministries, Spinters Road, Accra, Ghana, or any of his international branches across the world. 
Visit us on our social media handles, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat, TikTok, Clubhouse, at Daniel Amwating, or Zoom, dubbed Open Heaven Zoom, this and every Thursday 